Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today, as you can see, I am on my iPad because I'm going to be showing you how to make a song on GarageBand. GarageBand? Well, yeah. So you open GarageBand. I sound like I'm British whenever I say that. So you open up the app. And you see this plus icon over here, you press it. And just to clarify something real quick, you, anyone is uh, free to follow this tutorial to make a song. You just have to have some knowledge on, you know, key, uh, rhythm, beat. Generally, you need to have some music knowledge. And so, we're gonna start with the drums. I'm gonna use smart drums because they're a lot easier to control. And so you have these kick, snare, claps, hi-hats, cymbals, and the shaker. So basically, if you want to have a loud kick, you put it over here. If you want to have like a slightly more complicated snare beat, you put it over here. If you want quiet claps, you put it on the bottom right here. It says quiet, so it says complex, loud, and simple. You put the shaker in simple. You can put anything wherever you want and it will sound good. Just saying. And you can pretty much, you know, like, mix up, you know, where you put these, and so this is the, the beat that we're working with, for now, yours can be anything, and so you press this red circle right here to start recording it. And you do nothing, but just wait till the recording is over. And we're done with that. So we press, oh, we press this uh, icon with like three squares. And we go back to the menu and we scroll over. This is very crucial. You can skip it though. You can put a bass line into it. And so, let's see. What, what suits this uh, drum beat? So we can choose the bass line. So I found my baseline, and we are ready to record. Okay, so the baseline is done. And now we are, wait a second, yeah, so we are ready to put any instrument now in the song. 
I'm gonna go with the guitar. So I'm gonna go with a with a higher octave of what I just played on the bass, and it will sound really good. for now but you can go ahead and add anything you can add strings like violin viola cello double bass but I'm just gonna keep it simple with some some classic rock organ I'm gonna make it double so we get that high range so yeah and add anything else you want but that's basically it and here's how the finished product sounds You get the point. So, if you like this video, consider liking and subscribing. And, uh, well, yeah, so after you've done this whole thing, you press this uh, little icon that kind of looks like a piece of paper with a folded corner. And that saves your, uh, your song. I'm gonna name it something. I'm gonna name it YouTube. Just because this video is going onto YouTube. So, yeah, that's it. Thank you guys for watching. I'm gonna see you in the next video. Goodbye.